Hello, welcome to the channel. If this is your first time, kindly hit the subscribe button down below. It will help the channel grow. In this video, I'll show you how to deposit and withdraw crypto from external address into your ShapeShift mobile app. ShapeShift is the easiest way to get started with top cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, Chainlink, Litecoin, Dogecoin, Dash, Stablecoins, and many more. With ShapeShift, you can trade, track, receive, share, and even win free crypto every time someone makes a trade through Project Rainfall. Alright, let's get to the video. Let me open the app. Right now, they don't support Gmail account login on mobile app. It might be available in the future. And if you haven't registered, check video description for the sign up link and get free 10 Fox tokens, which is worth 0.45 each right now. Alright, Here's how ShapeShift Exchange mobile app looks like. Below, you'll see navigation tabs like Portfolio, Swap, and Settings. Under your portfolio, you'll see available assets that are supported and the ones you have added. To add token on your portfolio, tap on Show or Hide Assets. Here, you can scroll down or type on the search bar to look for the token you want to add, and then tap on the toggle button to activate it. Now, let me teach you how to deposit or withdraw your token. Under Portfolio, tap on the token you want to make transaction. Let me pick on Nexocoin. Here, you can see its price and your balance. Just tap it to switch. Underneath, you'll see the price chart and its details. For you to deposit, tap on the arrow pointing towards you. Here, you can scan the QR code or copy the address. You can also send a request payment link by tapping the tab Request Nexo. Then, enter FIO address to request payment from someone in its memo. You can create your FIO address by going to Settings and then click on FIO Name. FIO Name is a single unique identifier for all your crypto addresses like an email address for your wallet. With it, you can personalize name, request money, and do transaction with contacts. Create yours now by tapping on the Get FIO Name. Okay, now that you're familiar with it, let's get back. Let me give you another sample. Let's try USDT or Tether. So it will be the same thing to deposit USDT from other wallet. You can scan the QR code or copy the address. You can select a different token to deposit by tapping on the drop-down icon. Here, you can scroll down or search for the token on the search bar. Let me pick Bitcoin. Here, you can scan the QR code or copy the address. This time, I'll show you how to withdraw crypto on an external wallet. Go back to Portfolio and select the token you want to withdraw. Let me pick Bitcoin again. This time, click on the arrow pointing away from you. Here, you can change the token by tapping on the scroll down button. And here, you enter the BTC address or the FIO name that you are sending funds to. After, click Next. Here, input the amount you want to withdraw and just hit Next. Then, confirm your transaction. Let me pick a different token. Let me choose Binance Coin. Here, you tap on the arrow pointing away from you. Here, you pick the token and then paste the address, and you'll also need a memo for Binance Coin to do transaction. If you want to see a written detailed instruction, you can tap on how does this work. It will redirect you to a step-by-step -step instructions on how to do the process as well. You can also directly purchase coin on Shapeshift app by tapping on Buy Crypto. Here, you select your currency and the token you want to buy. Once decided, input the amount you want to buy and pick the payment method. They support Visa or MasterCard and Apple Pay. 
They also have Project Rainfall wherein when someone trade on the platform, an automatic lottery will commence and all the users with FOX tokens will be eligible to get lucky for their reward. If you're not yet registered, check the video description for the sign up link and get free 10 FOX tokens. You'll also see winners list for the Project Rainfall. Alright, that's all for this video. If you have questions, feel free to comment down below. And please don't forget to like, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell for more cryptocurrency video tutorials. See you on my next video.